Citizenship, Wealth Disparity and Modern Property Transmission Citizenship, Wealth Disparity and Modern Property Transmission Recent research has shown that citizenship is a critical factor for maintaining significant between country inequality in the current global order. This chapter contends that the growing global inequality gap is accompanied by a rise in the commercialization of citizenship. It investigates the rise of official economic citizenship, or citizenship by investment, initiatives, as well as the illicit traffic in EU passports. Introduction Traditional sociological perspectives see current social arrangements as constituted by attained features. Researcher contended that, in the past and in the present, citizenship has served as a major mechanism assuring the persistence of significant between country inequality in the current world system. The researcher argued that the growing global inequality gap is accompanied by a rise in the monetization of citizenship. Researcher investigated two market-based tactics for evading citizenship ascription. First, the establishment of formal economic citizenship programs, citizenship by investment, in Eastern Europe and the Caribbean. And second, the trading in EU passports. City Year gives one away. The emergence of citizenship as an organized union of individual burghers, according to Maxwell. Traced back to the ancient Greek polis and the medieval Occidental city. According to him, the concept that city air makes man free was the revolutionary invention that distinguished Occidental cities from all others. Over time, the status inequalities between free and unfree city people gave way to individual citizen equality before the law. Max Weber, a German sociologist, wrote of the political order in the ostensibly secularized European metropolis in 1871. Equal voting rights mean 